Breaking news, my wonderful people, is our very own brother, oh yes, who is back, Primate Ayodele, speaking into some of the uh, things that are happening currently right now, 2023 being the main focus and the watchword with regards to how things are and moving Nigeria forward, what the real issue should be. In case you are not aware, you'll be shocked and surprised at the current occurrences and this is what Prime Minister Yodili is saying to Nigerians that we must vote correctly or right or we leave our nation to another 20 years of peri. you see. So it is important that every one of us begin to pay, uh, pay attention and not give caution and not throw caution to the wind. We must ensure that we rise up as we should and bring Nigeria out of our present predicament. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button as we hear what Primate Ayodele has got to say with regards to 2023 election. 2023 election, Primate Ayodele tells Nigerians who they should vote for in order to serve and to save the nation from the current present predicament. The leader of the INRI Evangelical Spiritual Church, Primate Elisha Ayodele on Sunday explained the kind of president Nigerians should vote for in 2023 general elections. In a statement signed by his media aide, Oluwato Singh, Primate Ayodele said Nigerians needs to needs an intelligent president who fears God, has feeling for the poor, and is and is intentionally prepared to lead about improving the country's economy. He revealed that the nation needs an unbiased leader because a president who is not section who is not section would keep the nation united. Ayodele cautioned the citizens against voting for a president that would be a puppet to the past leaders, someone who will be greatly covered and they will be the determinant of what happens to him. He said this is the kind of person Nigerians should vote for as the next president of the country, someone who will make Nigeria better, one who is intelligent and has the fear of God, someone who has feeling for the poor and is intent as intentionally about making economy better, one who, who isn't sectional and does not have religious bias. We need someone who will create employment for the youth, who will fight corruption and will be and will and won't be a sectional leader. This present government is sectional in fighting corruption and insecurity. We need someone who will make a promise and fulfill it. Someone who will tell take Nigeria as its own nation and won't rule as a regional leader. Someone who will take education seriously and not use payment of workers' salaries as a campaign, as his own campaign money. Someone who will look after the prisoners. We need someone who has the mind to do restructuring. One who will be, uh, one who will, one who will not be a puppet to past leaders. One who will recognize the country, and work on infrastructures, invest heavily in agriculture. The clergy said Nigerians need a president who will fight injustice, shun electricity, and ensure it works properly, handles security properly. One who is bold and call on and call and call a spade a spade. We need someone who will fight injustice because there is corruption in injustice. Primate Ayodele disclosed that although none of the top candidates have all of this cultured trails excellently, God will pick God will teach the mind of the electorate to know better who they must pick. This is the kind of leader Nigeria God described to me that Nigerians need. Uh, one who among one who among the others will contribute meaningfully to the nation. God said he will touch the heart of Nigerians to see someone who has this, although among them, none of them has it excellently. We, we can't do 
we can't do what we've been doing before for 2023 but we get someone who makes that will make life better for nigerians so this is what our very own brother primate ayo is saying with regards to you know currently what's going on right now you see